welcome to another episode of Naomi the Chi. On today's episode, we are getting into the energy of you beautiful Aquarius people, okay? I wonder what color hair y'all are rocking these days. You know, y'all love to switch the hair color up. That's just y'all thing. That's what y'all love to do. Y'all love to look like, almost like alien-like, you know, out of this world. All right, let's see what information you have for me to give to my Aquarius people. All right, off bat, I feel like you guys could be going through a lot of aggression this week. What's going on? I feel like there's a lot of fiery energy around you right now. You've probably been feeling the need to, like, let out some steam or some aggression or some, um, you know, I don't know. You might even be feeling very hot right now. And I just feel like right now you guys could be feeling emotional about some stuff that's going on in your life that you feel like you might not have no control over. Um, one thing about you, Aquarius, is, is um, you're not one for relinquishing control okay you guys love to be in control but y'all don't do it in a very aggressive way y'all do it in a mind trip type of way y'all like to like send people on dummy missions only so they just don't catch up to what it is that you're actually thinking um at the time you know what i'm saying if that makes sense like y'all like to set people up to be thinking that you're thinking over here to the left when really you're over here to the right like that's your way of controlling stuff and i feel like right now I don't know, for some reason, I feel like you guys are going through a period of time where you might be feeling like things are out of your control, but uh, 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 it's not out of your control. You are still very much in control. This is just the beginning stages of stuff. So stuff might not be the way you might perceive it to be at first, but eventually, once you change your perspective or as time goes on, this energy will change. And this energy is going to be very quick too. So it's not like it's going to be something that's going to last for a long time. Um, I feel like you could be feeling like you're in competition with some people or some people could be in competition with you or they just feel like you guys got so much of the spotlight on you right now and they're trying to figure out for what reason. Like Aquarius isn't even that special. Why is everybody just on them so hard? Um, you guys could be going through that right now. And my whole thing is when it's like that and you don't feel like, like I don't know why the spotlight is on me. <laughs> I'm just an average person, you know, the average Joe or whatever. And when you feel like that, it's because you have an aura or a glow about you that everybody sees. You just got to realize that too. Pop your collar, like I always say. If people see it in you, then it must be something that's obviously there. And you need to see that in yourself as well. So I feel like this week, it could be a little bit of a confrontation with people. They could be sparking this um, aggression. Um, and I feel like it's really because of your perception as to what is going on you know around you like maybe you're not perceiving yourself to be as dope as they do but it's time for you to go ahead and start seeing it and i feel like you guys for some people some of y'all could be feeling isolated some of y'all could be feeling suppression and i feel like um you could be suppressing the way you you feel that's probably what it is that's giving you so much aggression my aquarius people for the umpteenth time I want y'all to get close, come to the front of the room, okay? Y'all learn how to say what it is you have to say on your mind. If it come out a little messed up and it hurts somebody's feelings, if you step on somebody's toes, if you crush however it is that they feel for the day, so be it. It don't, it feels better to let it out and say what it is you have to say and then go back. If you feel like what you said was so bad, then go back and be like, okay, well, let me help you pick up the pieces that just fell out on the floor, okay? Yeah, let me help you. You know, I know I just broke that dish. You know what I'm saying? But now let me help you pick this up, okay? I, you, It's okay to go back and be like, hey, you know, I said what I said. I meant it. But if it hurts your feelings, I apologize for hurting your feelings. I apologize it had to come out like that. But I still said what I said. You see what I'm saying? I feel like so if you guys are feeling like you have to suppress or tiptoe, on marble floors around people i can't say this because it's going to hurt their feelings it's going to set them off if i say that i don't know how they're going to take it get that out of your mind okay you guys need to go ahead and step into your power okay your power of knowing <laughs> when you're right you're right be right about something even if you're wrong be wrong about something just stand on it okay 
speak your mind and say what's on your mind and stop holding it back because honestly holding it back is eating you alive okay and i see it it is messing with certain aspects in your life okay now we've been going on and on and on and i ain't even tell y'all to do the youtube stuff so let's go ahead and do the youtube stuff i'm watching yep liking the video great did you subscribe Yep, subscribe to the video, like the video, and also comment. Let me know how this energy uh, resonates in your life. But I feel like, you guys, for some people, could just be really experiencing downloads of information from spirit as well. Like for some people, I know that it was random. But I feel like, um, as I'm letting spirit talk to me, I feel like you guys are like really becoming more patient with yourself as well like maybe it's like okay i understand that i move like this i understand that you know my aggression might be eating me up but i feel like for some reason i'm right where i'm supposed to be i'm supposed to be going through this i need to pa practice patience you know what i'm saying if you guys feel like that if you don't feel like you got a cuss in your spirit and, it, and the time is not right now don't do it okay then don't do it then just hold your mouth hold tight until it, until the smoke clears but i just feel like for some people you guys need to go ahead and speak with and say what's on your mind the fast way babies let's see what else spirit has for you and i see a celebration is near for some of you guys um could possibly see a pregnancy or someone around you is pregnant um, you could be finding out the birth, about a birth of someone heavy on that, <laughs> super heavy on that. Damn, somebody could be um, pregnant around you as well. I feel like somebody around you is pregnant and it could be, um, if it's not you or someone you know, if it is you, um, you might be feeling alone in this thing. You know, you might be feeling like you don't really have a lot of support. Um, you might be feeling like you're going to be having to go at this as a single mom or a dad. Um, or if you know someone who's going through this and, you know, I feel like with time, um, you guys, with time, things can change. It, it might be the energy that you're in right now. You could be sitting back in isolation and feeling like you don't have the support of your family or support of the, your significant other at this time and you feel just isolated and i hate the way that feels i know exactly how that feels and i'm so sorry to you you guys could just be trying to hide this thing right now and um if that is the case if you guys are hiding a pregnancy or if you know someone that is hiding a pregnancy reach out to them and, and talk to them and you know when somebody is pregnant you might be having dreams about fishes and stuff like that um, or you might even dream about losing your teeth. I know that was a big one too. Um, you might even dream about actual babies, but somebody around you is pregnant and they're not taking it well about the news of knowing this um, because they might not feel like they have people around them that's gonna help them. And I feel like whoever is pregnant, they're probably about to give birth soon. Um, or I feel like it's gonna be soon or soon they're gonna have to eventually come out and just come front confront what it is that's on their mind and it could just be a thing like you know you might not even know i ain't gonna say like who the father is but you might not even know um where your help is gonna come from y'all you might not even know you might just find out that you might have help all around you the whole time you know what i'm saying even if it's not the person you want it to be it could be somebody very unlikely um and i really want to uh if this last message is for whomever it is um you're not alone uh, spirit is always watching spirit is always with you and spirit will always have people around you they are there to help you you just gotta open your eyes and change the way you view things okay i'm gonna go ahead and let you guys go here and congratulations to whoever this is that is having a baby mm -hmm. i just want to give it a kiss for you all right well go right ahead we'll see each other on the next go round, girl let me go ahead and call my other caller I'll see you guys later. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, like the video, all the stuff. Okay, great. Mm -hmm.